and let me go ahead and give you a look around. Let's start here in the aft, and here's another shot of these twin 1998 Yamaha 130s saltwater series. And here's a good shot with the cowling off. They just look very well cared for, very clean. And these engines, to flush them, all you need to do is hook a hose up. You don't need mufflers or anything. And then if we go directly to port, here in the aft, you're going to see a live well. And then if I move over to the starboard side and I lift up here, you have another live well. This owner currently uses it just for storage because he doesn't need two. But you have a second live well in that corner. Then moving slightly forward, if I lift up here, you're going to see your starboard battery. And if I move over to the other side, you're going to see your port. Also, the owner is including the battery charger system. And that will bring us dead center in the floor. And if I lift up here, you have a very large fish box. Or you could use it as storage. Moving over to the starboard side, you'll see your battery switches. And then if I move around, that will bring us up to our helm seat. And below the helm seat, you'll see a cooler that goes right with it. And directly to the port of that, you'll see a swim ladder that attaches to the aft. And that will bring us up to our helm. And let's start at the top here. Up top, you'll see in the electronics box, on the one on the right, you just have a lot of storage. The one on the left, you'll see your VHF radio. These are all gas-assisted hinges, all working correctly. Move down, and you have your compass, and that'll bring us to our electronics. Here, you'll see it as a Lowrance Elite 4X HDI, and that is a fish finder depth sounder. Now this Lawrence is outfitted with the downscan technology, the newest technology. And then if I move over to the right, you'll see a Garmin GPS map 172C. And that moves us down directly in front of the captain, and you're going to see your Yamaha digital gauges laid out right in front of the captain. And then directly to the right of that, if I open up here, you're going to see all your switches to power your boat. They do a nice job in the celebrity of keeping those protected behind a closed door. And then if I move over here, you're just going to see storage. Then if I move down below, you're going to see your trim tabs. Then below that, you'll see your cup holders. And if I go way below this and I open up here, you're going to see a new stereo. And this stereo also is iPod ready. And now if we move forward, we move up to the bow area, and Celebrity really does a remarkable job on this bow area. If I go ahead and I flip around, you'll just see what looks like to be a mammoth storage area. But if I go ahead and I just unbuckle these and open this up and lift up, and it stays up with gas-assisted hinge. And then in the side here, you have a little door, and if you just open up the door, you have entry into what only can be called a remarkable size head for a 23 center console. You'll just see a ton of room along with a porta potty and then there that back curtain can be removed and give you excellent access to the back of your helm. And now if I turn around and show you the bow, if I lift up here, once again a great fish box storage area and that all lifts out and provides even more storage underneath. And then if I move forward once again, lift up another fish box storage area. And now I'll just turn around and that'll show you this T-top. Now this has got a T-top with uh, storage for life preservers. Plus you're going to have a spreader on the front. And if I move to the back, you're going to see it's got rocket launchers and two spreaders in the aft. And now's the time of the video where I give a condition report and also tell about opportunities for the next owner. 
Uh, I would say this boat is in very good condition for a 1995 23 center console with 98 motors. It just shows real well. I don't see stress cracks. The floor is nice and hard. Um, everywhere you look around it, it looks to be in good condition. I will tell you that I believe that a good detail would go a long way with this boat. Just, you know, a nice buffing and whatnot. But it is uh, in very nice shape. And everything works on the boat. All the accessories, all the switches. And Celebrity just did a good job with the design.